Some updates on the bus crash in China that killed 10 Korean nationals and a Chinese driver. Victims' families are now arriving in the northeastern Chinese city of Jian, site of the accident. According to our Kim Min-ji, CCTV footage recorded at the scene has been released, hopefully providing some clues as to what caused that accident. Bereaved family members are arriving at a funeral hall in the Chinese city of Jian, set up for 10 Koreans who were killed in a bus crash earlier this week. They will meet with the Korean government's emergency response team dispatched to the area to discuss how to transfer the bodies back to Korea, as well as compensation and other related issues regarding the accident. The wounded have been moved to a hospital in northeast China's Jilin province to receive intense treatment. Local doctors say among the 16 injured, one is in critical condition, while seven are seriously wounded. The victims were among Korean government employees who were on a training trip to China. The Korean consulate in Shenyang has set up a situation room in a hotel in the province to help deal with the aftermath of the accident. China is disturbed about this accident and doing its best to find the exact cause. Although an investigation is currently underway, witnesses are pointing to driver error as the cause of the accident. CCTV footage shows the bus making a sharp turn and crashing into a pier before eventually veering off the bridge. Chinese officials say it may have been caused by driver inexperience, but have not ruled out other possible causes, including mechanical errors. Eleven people were killed after a bus carrying 28 people veered off a bridge and plunged 15 meters into a river in the city of Jian on Wednesday. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.